So hello friends, welcome back to my YouTube channel. So let us quickly see today's question. So we have a rectangle PQRS which is shaded in blue and we have a circle with center O and there is a chord MS whose length is given as 17 cm. We are asked to find the area of the blue shaded region. So blue shaded region is a rectangle. This is given in the question. In order to find the area of a rectangle, we must have its length and width. But here explicitly length and width are not given. So how are we going to solve this? Let's have a look. So first of all, let us assume that the radius of this circle be r. So this length will be r. This length will also be r. Why? We can see that PQ is tangent to circle. We are not assuming the figure is drawn in such a way that PQ is tangent. So from point O, that is center, to the point of contact of this tangent, if we draw a line, then this line will be perpendicular. So this is also R. So if this is R, PS will also be R. In fact, if OS is R, then if we name this point as N, so NP will also be R. So in short, we can say that P and OS is a square. Now let us take this distance as Y and this distance as X. We are just assuming randomly NQ as Y and MQ as X. So this will also be Y. What about this distance MR? So from Q to R, this length is R. We have this and from q to m it is x so this will be r minus x so we have three unknowns the radius r y and x the only known thing is length of this chord fm which is 17 units so let us first focus on this triangle s r m this is a right angle triangle so we will use pythagorean theorem here so this will give us r plus y whole square, let me write r plus y whole square plus r minus x whole square so plus r minus x whole square is equal to 17 units. This is the first equation. Likewise, if we join O m, this will be radius and in triangle O r m, we can again apply Pythagorean theorem. So this will give us y square plus r minus x whole square is equal to the hypotenuse that is r square. This is equation number 2. So from equation 2, we can rewrite it as r minus x whole square is equal to r square minus y square. This is the value of r minus x whole square which we can substitute in equation 1. So equation 1 becomes r plus y whole square and in place of r minus x whole square we can have this value that is plus r square minus y square is equal to 17 square. 17 square is 289. Now let us expand this. So this will give us r square plus y square plus 2ry and outside we have r square minus y square is equal to 289. So plus y square minus y square gets cancelled. r square plus r square is 2r square plus 2ry is equal to 289. We can take two common from uh, to the terms of left hand side. So let me rewrite here. So 2 times r square plus ry is equal to 289. So r square plus r y will be 289 divided by 2 which is equal to 144.5. Now we have found the value of r square plus r y. Now how we are going to link this with uh, finding the area of this uh, blue rectangle. So if we focus on this entire rectangle it can be divided into two parts. The first part is this which is a square and the area of a square is side times side. So r times r is r square. 
so this is r square and this is a rectangle whose length is y units and width is how much width is r okay width is r and length is y so this the area is r times y and if we add these two r square plus r y we will get the area of this entire blue rectangle and that is what we have got r square plus r y is equal to 144.5 square units or in fact it is centimeter so this will be 144.5 centimeters square if you like this video do subscribe to my channel see you in the next video